Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do an update for my pen and everything project pen and I'm doing this with a bunch of lovely ladies here on YouTube and Instagram. It is created by Jessica and you should check her out if you haven't already. She is currently sick I think so she's not really updating anything on her youtube channel but you should definitely check out her videos she is amazing and she i don't know what to to call her other than just amazing and really awesome i love her humor and everything that she stands for on her channel so please check her out and of course the other ladies in this project i will link them all down below we are trying to hit pan on everything in our collection pan and everything it self-explanatory i think i have hit two new pans for this update and i'm working on four items in total those two are eyeshadows and <laughs> i'm really excited about it so let me show you guys the two new pans the roll-ins and then my progress that i think is pretty good as well so i'm very excited about this update so yeah let's just get into the video the first eyeshadow comes from my Too Faced chocolate bar palette and it is a shade that i Hit major pan on in my panda palette. I have repressed it and then I put it into this project just to hit pan again. And I did very quickly. It is salted caramel right here. I'm really excited to have pan on this again. I love this shade so much. I'm a little bit sad it goes so fast because I, I love that shade. But yes, I did hit pan on this one again. The next eyeshadow or the next pan comes from my W7 Major Matte eyeshadow palette and it is the shade number five and it is the shade here in the middle as you can see the shiny pan and i can just tell you the roll-ins because they comes from they come from this palette because i do use one of them every single day so i thought why not just put it into the project and then just put another shade in from this palette so i don't have that many items to grab grab for can you see that uh, in the morning time so the two shades that i'm rolling in are these two right here i know they are bigger and they are probably going to take a long time to pan on because i have used this as a brow bone shade for so long you can see there is a dip forming but if i know this palette well which i do there is a long way to pan on this shade but yes that is the state of the shadow as you can see the dip there and this one has the smallest dip as well but i'm very excited to be using these two so this is going to be my if i can stop putting my finger into the dark shade that would be nice this is going to be a brow bone shade for every single day because i do and this is going to be a transition shade Let's take this one because this is not very exciting compared to the, the last item I have in the project. This is my Neil Shore eyeshadow. It's, it's like a cream to powder eyeshadow. I use it underneath my shimmer shadows in my panel palette. It is called Soft Cover and it is this beautiful shade right here. I love using it on my eyelid for my shimmer shadows. But I've only used it like one or two times. Maybe two times. Can I bump it up to three? I don't know. <laughs> but I haven't used it much. So there will be a long way to hit pan on this one still. But I have used it. <laughs> I have. I have used it. Then we have my highlighter. It is the W7 Glow Motion Pink It Up Shimmer Highlighter Eyeshadow whatever product. This one right here if you were curious. If, if you haven't seen my videos. Can you see that dip? That dip is so huge. I'm very surprised that I haven't hit pan yet, but I guess the pan is very deep. <laughs> but yes, look at that dip. That is so exciting. And it is very weird shaped, to be honest. I don't normally wear my pants like that. The dip goes inwards and then it just stops. So it has this weird edge. But it is exciting and there's a long way to go still, but... That dip is huge. <laughs> huge. Okay, that was my small update. It, I guess it is exciting and not really at the same time. I really hope I can have some pants for you guys next time. But I kind of doubt it. Um, I don't think I can. I will do my best though. I will do my absolute best. I have no idea which one it will be first. But 
it would be fun to see which one you guys think that I hit pan on first of these four. Or if you even think I can hit pan on one of them by next update. I would look forward to see you guys in the comments and guessing. If I should guess, it actually might be either this eyeshadow or the white beige shade for my highlight, brow bone shade. I don't think I can hit pan on the highlighter by next update, but I will, I will do my best to do so. But yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this small video and this update. Check out the other ladies if you haven't already. Subscribe to my channel. I hope to see you guys next time.